what I'm really here to do, show you this. So this is what I've got. That's what it's called, bun. Yi is like sweet or dessert, and lam, the color aqua, like between green and blue. One of my students got it for me. My student actually has a YouTube channel, and his family were in um, Hanoi, and that's where he got this for me. But he also did some videos, so every class, we at the start, we watch his videos. It's just so exciting. He's such a cool kid. I think that's cornstarch because it's not sweet. We were pulling it apart. This is everywhere already. Um, when we're pulling it apart, it doesn't look... It's very strict. Okay, there's nuts in it for sure. But it's like a... a and it smells like... Maybe ginger? I don't know what to call this. Um, I don't think it's something that I'm going to be craving in the future. <laughs> I, no. Like a jelly maybe. But... It doesn't have that much flavour. You can definitely taste the nuts. So it's a Hanoi thing. Um, I was asking my co-workers about it and they said that they'd never tried that that they had never tried it just because it's from up north and they don't really get it down here. This is conflicting. Very confusing. Anyway, back to vlog. Quadro. Quadro! <laughs> weekend is done with hey i found thai kimchi so vegetarian kimchi i'm gonna butcher this but i didn't butcher it enough that the man didn't know what i was saying <clears throat> which means mango dessert basically it has become apparent to me that i I get approached a lot and spoken to. Everyone would just say hi or smile or wave. A lot of people do it. I'm a foreigner, so I understand why it happens. But other foreigners don't have a lot of the same experiences. I understand why, being a white female, that is very tall. I'm not saying it's bad or good. Um, some days I feel like it's bad and some days I feel like it's good. Today I feel like it's amazing. I was standing on the bridge, um, this lotus bridge is beautiful. Anyway, a woman comes up and she's like, hey, and I was like, hi. She just spoke about herself a bit and that she's from a province nearby and like we just talked about studying and traveling and stuff like that. Uh, she was like, oh, like, I'm about to go. And I was like, yo, I need to go home too. Like, I'm walking home. Oh, yo, um, let me add you on Facebook. And, like, we can catch up sometime. She searches herself on Facebook. And it says that she's from Kamau. And I was like, yo, you're from Kamau. Stop. Man, I want to go to Kamau so bad. Yeah, so bad. That is, like, my one place. And she was like, yeah, just tell me. I was like, yo, like, I'm serious. And she's like, yeah, like... We'll go down hopefully I can make that happen because that's like goals. You know what I mean? Goals. Anyway, it is now the 9th of December, which means your girl has been in Vietnam for six whole months. Six months. It's crazy. I'm so proud I've made it. It feels like so much longer. So much has happened. So much has changed. I am proud of myself for like taking the leap of faith and trusting myself. Making moves. Girl making moves. Girl is not making money moves. But girl is making moves.
was important here. It's snack time again. When isn't it in my world? You get them everywhere, but here it only costs a few cents. So. Not in toffee. Yeah. Amazing. Sweet, nutty, caramelly. I didn't know if I was gonna like. <gasps> just let me show off my fingernails. You've just gotta have a really strong jaw. Like you can only eat so many of them before you're like, ow. Corn, chili. I'm gonna say they're vegetarian because they don't taste weird. So to note, I'm a teacher in Vietnam. Um, I teach English. Tis the season for Christmas, but tis the season for exams. Oh my days. Although it's good for prep, there's basically none. Posts, ugh. Comments, marking. Definitely not my most favorite thing to do.